25 of the Scott Henderson 30 Day Blues Challenge. What we're gonna do today is more of a concept than a lick. If you think about all the chords in the blues in A as diminished, as symmetric diminished, half whole, meaning A7 gets A half whole, D7 gets D half whole, and E7 gets E half whole, you have all these triads floating around. So for the one chord, we're just gonna keep the A7. But we're gonna use a substitution for the D chord, for the four chord. We're gonna play B instead, because it's in the same symmetric diminish. And for that E, we're gonna do the same trick we did for the D. We're gonna think about C sharp major instead, because it's in the same symmetric diminished. I'm basically substituting the triad for a triad that's a minor third down or a major six up, however you wanna think about it. But, if I do that, notice what happens. My one chord is right here. My four chord, I just go a whole step up and play on a B7. And my five chord is right here, another whole step up from there. So if I play through an entire blues, here's what I got. Weird sounds. One, two, three. So I played one. Then I played the four chord right here, a whole step up, but with the tensions that go with it. Then the five chord right here. Four. Pretty cool concept, right? Learn it, it's very good for you. Tabs are available down there in the Patreon. Check out the Patreon for all your tab needs, supplementary materials, Barlow guitars are sick, not slick, sick. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow.